Hello, my name's James. I'm going to show you how to top the pressure up on your boiler. The display on the boiler might have a fault code like on the screen at the moment, or it might have flashing lights as well as a low pressure gauge. So this boiler is given an E10 fault code, which is low system pressure. So if you look at the pressure gauge, you can see it's probably 0.5 bar. So it probably wants to be, well, it definitely wants to be at one. Um, it wants to be at one minimum. It doesn't want to be at two. So just let's just top it up a little bit at a time. So underneath, this is the filling loop. This is the cold. This is a cold filter. So this is the, the mains cold pipe. And then this loop connects the mains cold to the heating. So what we'll do is we'll open this tap, quarter turn, and open this tap, quarter turn. So as I open that, we can hear water going. So we'll look back up at the pressure gauge. You can see it's gone up a little bit. So I'll do it again, a little bit at a time. Close that back. A little bit more. See, it's already fired back up now. The pressure switch has kicked in. We'll just put a little bit more. So there's no rush with this. It's better to put a little bit at a time than put too much in. You might be overpressurized. So that's at one. Perfect. So the next video is topping the pressure up on the Ideal Logic or the Ideal Vogue. Just going to show you how to uh, top pressure up on this. Uh, the pressure's already up, so it's up to about one and a half. When it cools down, it'll go to about one. If you do ever need to top this up, quarter turn that valve and then quarter turn this valve and you can hear water flowing. If you look at this gauge, see it moves a little bit and then just shut them back off as there was before. Yeah. On the next video, I'm going to show you how to top the pressure up on a new Worcester Green Star. So when you need to top the pressure up, underneath the boiler, there's a little, little blue lever. When you hold that lever down, that lets water from the cold side go into the heating and pressurize it up. On the next video, I'm gonna show you how to top the pressure up on a Worcester Green Star Junior with the internal filling key. If you take the lid down, there should be a key in there take that out, put it into the slot, twist it, lock it in place, and then open the fill-in screw. And you'll notice the pressure gauge will start slowly going up. And that's letting cold water into the heating side. So we do this nice and slow. Pressure gauge will slowly rise up. So it's still filling. And then when you're done, you just close that fill-in screw and remove the key.